Hello there YouTube, does dribbling still feel bad in FIFA 23? Then don't worry, in this video I am going to teach you this overpowered dribbling trick. So in order to perform this technique we are going to use both L1 straight dribbling and R1 agile dribbling. Now we are gonna use both of these together, yes you might be thinking how, let me show you. Remember, we are using straight dribbling in order to keep the ball closer to our feet and bait the opponent into getting the ball away from us. And we are going to use agile dribbling for quick snappy turns like you can see in these clips right. We are using L1 in order to keep the ball closer to our feet. The moment the opponent will come close to us, we will hold the R1 button and make a quick turn right and turn away from him because the r1 agile dribbling allows us to make quick snappy turns right so guys in this clip we are using the agile dribbling to go right to left left to right and then exit with the sprint boost afterwards we are once again going to use the l1 button in combination with the agile dribbling look using l1 button the moment he gets closer we use the r1 button to turn away from him he gets beaten if the opponent has low composure like this one he will get beaten he will be sent to mars guys absolutely overpowered dribbling technique all you have to do is to make sure that you are using l1 to keep the ball close to your feet, the moment the opponent gets closer to you, you will just simply touch the R1 button and decide either you want to go left or right and exit in that direction. If you have ample of space, you can also exit with the R2 button. The result is usually incredible, very fun to use and a great way to dribble on FIFA. What I have noticed this year on FIFA 23 that using agile dribbling, using strafe dribbling is much better than using the normal left stick dribbling and you need to master these mechanics and if you do it in combination like I've shown you today there is no way that you are not going to improve at left stick dribbling however guys you still need to take care of one more thing and that is to caress the left stick like this right and make sure that you are not spamming it like this like I've shown you before because once you're caressing it in agile dribbling mode the result is incredible the player makes amazing turns guys so make sure that you are not spamming it like this and you are actually just being very smooth. Now click here to learn an overpowered crossing trick. 